Hey guys, it's Megan from Jamunkey, and today we're going to be talking about how to make these really adorable witch hat cookies. They're super tasty, super easy to make, and they are perfect for any Halloween gathering. Here's what you need for this project. Dixie Crystals powdered sugar, some honey, some green fondant, Oreo cookies, and some peanut butter. First, we're gonna start by making edible Play-Doh. You need two cups of Dixie Crystals powdered sugar. Then you're gonna add in your honey, which is half a cup. Then we're gonna add our cup of peanut butter. Mix together the ingredients the best you can until you can't mix it with the spoon anymore. Now it's time to get dirty and finish mixing with our hands. You could also add food coloring to this Play-Doh to make it fun and colorful, but we're actually gonna cover it with Oreo so it won't matter. Set your edible Play-Doh aside in an airtight container. Now we need to make some Oreo crumbs. Separate the Oreos and scrape out the inside. You can set it aside or just eat it as you go. You only need a handful of them. Place the cookies into a plastic bag and close it up. Now what we're gonna do is, is we're going to take a rolling pin and smash the cookies into crumbs. Now that we have everything we need, it's time to start building our witch hats. So we have our Play-Doh and our Oreo cookie dust. We're gonna start molding our edible Play-Doh into triangles for our witch hats. This is a great fun project that's easy for kids to participate in also. You'll wanna flatten the bottom of it so that it'll stick to the Oreo well. Once you have it shaped into a little witch's hat, it's time to roll it in Oreo crumbs. Roll the top part of the witch's hat in Oreo crumbs, making sure to pat it down, but make sure that you leave the bottom portion of the Play-Doh sticking out so that it sticks to the Oreo better. Now it's time to place the top of the hat onto the cookie. You just place it onto the cookie and press down you can better shape the hat now that it's on the cookie. There is our cute little witch's hat. We're gonna set it aside and make a few more before we put our finishing touches on it. I've rolled the green fondant very thin and cut it into little strips so that we can put it around the hat as the ribbon. Now I'm just going to drape it across the hat If you need help making the fondant stick, just get it a little wet and it will stick together much easier. There you have it, simple witch hats that are easy and kid friendly to make. If you liked this video, give it a big thumbs up and make sure you subscribe for more videos like it. And check out my website, jamunky.com.